This is a luxury watch. It's nice though. This is a few thousand dollars right here. It's is pretty it? dope, huh? Yeah, it's real nice. So I actually got a couple of these, so just want to give a quick shout out to uh, the owners for sending out this watch. Dude, those Invictus are pretty, uh, I, need a, I, I used to like them because they're like bulky, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I like the, I need a big ass heavy watch because I got a big ass All right, wrist. just make sure to uh, start bleeping this out because what we're doing now, no swearing yeah. whatsoever. Gotcha. So that way we don't get uh, demonetized. demonetized. And we're trying to make as much as money as we can on YouTube. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, look at this. They must have some sort of training going on right here. Oh, he's scratching your car. He's scratching it. That's a $180,000 car. <laughs> Where the people in there are like, what's going on? I know. Oh, that's Chuck. It's he a YouTuber. Can I call you back, please? Hey, how you doing? Going over to Fountain Head Circle. Design Zone Remodeling. Design Zone? Yeah, Design Zone Remodeling. Man, that exhaust is killing me. Here you go. Oh, sorry. Do you want to go shopping? No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> You're all set. Thank you so much. You know, I'm probably going to die soon. I'm going to be in between this shit all the time. That's not good. I know. All right, so we're up here in, uh, where are we at? Anthem Country Club, right? Yeah. Exclusive neighborhood. We've uh, shot some videos before up here uh, with the Folklet Brothers. Um, they're doing a million dollar flip property. Well, multi-million dollar flip property, so we'll probably drop that in the link in the description below. But uh, this is a very exclusive neighborhood. Kind of make a loop that goes around. Oh, he, got, he has his tailgate closed, you see that? I mean, open. That's not good. So in this uh, master community here, we have neighborhoods. This is uh, Willow Nose. As you can see, it's all single story homes. And believe it or not, you can only park on one side of the street in this neighborhood. Just a quick tip. However, uh, I don't know where I'm going. I think we may be a little bit early. Let's see what Vitelli is. Y'all ready? Hey, take a look at this, man. We got this upside down. <laughs> wow, look at this. They busted this all out already. All the drywall. Oh, shower glass. Let's take that one for mine. Oh, it's locked here in here. Let's see what the code is. Good, where you at, brother? Okay. Yeah, I'm already here. Hey, what's the what's the code? Ow. <laughs> Dang, they gutted this house. Wow, look at this. This was all originally had tile in here. And you can see where all the mud for the tile is. Now they're going to have to sand this down, scrape it. Kitchen, open floor plan. So it looks like initially there was an island right here. And as you can see, right here was basically the sink, the refrigerator, the hood. They retextured all this right here. It's crazy. You see this concrete on the floor where it's cracked? You're like, dude, what's going on? That could be a little bit nerve wracking, you know? This is actually the, I believe the suite over here, isn't it? Oh no, it's not. So we got the laundry room. You got the bedroom here. 
Oh, it has a, a little casita too. For some of you guys that have been watching me for a while, y'all know that I ain't really good at opening doors for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> but we, we did check out that home, though, a little bit more. But she'll have all the breakdowns, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, she's going to have all, all the invoices okay, cool. and everything for it. Hey, real quick, my good buddy, Vitelli, right? Design Zone Remodeling, and they are transitioning into Design Zone Construction. That's right. They're about to... Well, let me correct myself. You're not even about to. You guys are already starting yeah. on a custom home. They're actually building a custom home. So um, I'm actually very interested to go check that out. And this company's growing really fast. So I just want to mention real quick, if you guys are interested in remodeling your home, just like this one right here that we're about to tour, right? Uh, give them a call. I will have a link in the description below. And uh, so what's going on with this? It's uh, just a, you know, remodel. Full, yeah, full house, a full house remodel, 2100 square feet house. Uh, we basically do everything here: custom cabinets, flooring, yeah. painting, pretty much all the bathrooms and stuff like that. Yeah, we you guys gutted this house, right? Didn't you? Like everything. Not like everything. Everything cosmetic, I yeah. would say. You know, we didn't remove the drywall and stuff. Yeah. So. So the 2100 square feet is that with the um, casita? Yeah, including the casita. We actually been here for quite some time, like a couple of weeks already. Yeah. So we did all the demo already. So demo's done. So what, what are you guys doing in this right here? Just a uh, tile throughout. Okay. You know, it's going to be tile flooring everywhere, like mm -hmm. wood looking tile. Yeah. And new bathrooms, tile. What's going on with this right here? Get over here, guys. So we're going to have a tile here mm -hmm. all you the way to the ceiling. Same tub. Did you guys redo the plumbing on this too or no? Yeah, we had to do the new fixtures. So yeah. the, the new valves is in there. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a little different valves. One thing that I learned with um, doing remodeling homes, I realized contractors don't like it to do other contractors work. And that's a mistake I did make. Remember when I did the plumbing? So I did a plumbing because I tried to outsource everything myself and realized I just didn't have the time. So I brought these guys in to do it. But the plumbers are like, dude, we don't want to do somebody else's work. So that's just a quick tip for you guys. So it's better just to hire a contractor because they got all their people. Thanks. So what is, this is just going to be paint, baseboards, basically? Yeah. So this is still old paint color. In the house, there is already painted. So yeah. there is a new color already in okay. the main house. But this is just in the plan right now. So yeah. it's not confirmed yet. So this is probably going to be over a hundred something thousand dollars in our remodel, right? Yeah, about hundred... Together with the materials, about 150. Okay. So it looks like they had some wood tiles here at one point. Yeah, it was like. glued down wood floor. It's pain in the ass to remove this floor, you know. Yeah. It's kind of. And then prep it for the new tile. Uh -huh. So here is going to be the kitchen. Okay. The cabinet is going to go all the way up to here. What and about this island? Because this island looked a little bit small too, huh? Yeah, it was a small island. So we're going to make a big island here. Okay. It's going to be custom cabinets, so the... What kind of cabinets are we putting in? Uh, it's going to be two-tone, white okay. and gray, but the custom-made. And the countertops? What kind of countertops? Countertops is going to be like a quartz, like a similar to the condo. And okay. the cabinet's going to go all the way to the ceiling. The top cabinet is going to have glass. Oh, nice. And, and you guys put lights in there too or no? Yeah, some LEDs in the glass cabinets. Oh, that's dope. Okay. All right, guys. So. And this area, we're gonna have a built-ins. So it's gonna be framed for the fireplace in the middle. And on the sides, it's gonna be custom cabinetry, built-ins, uh, matching the cabinets in the bathroom. So that fireplace you're doing, you're not doing a gas fireplace. This no, is no. just more of yeah. aesthetics. Yeah, electric fireplace. Yeah, that's the one with the all different colors yeah. that you can pick. How, uh, how big are they doing this one? Uh, I believe it's gonna be 36 inches. No, it's got to be more than that. Or 42, <laughs> 42 inches, 42, yeah. <laughs> like that, there you go. That's going to be a small little fireplace. <laughs> yeah, yeah the, the whole wall is going to be, I believe, 40, 48 inches. Okay. And the fireplace is going to be about 40, I don't remember to be honest, but okay. about, about 40 inches around that. Oh, so they're doing that built out, like coming up like this, then you have that fireplace. Yeah, the fireplace over here is going to be TV. Okay. And ca but cabinets. What's all this? Oh, mm -hmm. just cabinets going down? Yeah, so it's going to be the cabinets here and cabinets here. Oh, that's gonna look nice. 
And uh, what size baseboard are you guys doing? So I believe like six inch straight edge. Oh, so it's gonna be more the modern look then? Yeah, kind of, you know. We're gonna have some interesting design ideas in the flooring, mm -hmm. integrated in the flooring. Like yeah. we're gonna have this, um, you know, like a cubes. When you walk in, yeah. you're gonna have like a accent tile on the, on the start and okay. it's gonna be a couple of cubes in the oh in, in that that's area. Gonna be pretty dope i don't know if you guys ever seen that and what he's talking about it's like it's gonna like typically with the tiles and i don't know if you guys seen this on like those modern magazines where you have i think they're like the octagon tiles right yeah. you're talking about yeah octagon we're gonna have in the bathroom but this one's is more like a like a cube like you know like a 3d cube oh really so it's it's a tile but it's, it looks like a cube i wish i would have a picture but we're gonna see it you know. So basically, it's not gonna, normally the tile just like transitions like a straight edge here, then it transitions to something else, but you're gonna uh, make it where it blends in and it yeah. transitions to a different tile? Yeah, yeah. So cube's gonna start from here, and then there's gonna be one over there, then one over there, so basically not random. Yeah, yeah. Like but then it'll blend in, and what tile's going here? And then it's gonna be a wood-looking long tile. Oh, that's pretty dope. What do we got going on over here? Yeah, it's, uh, ceiling is being Just remind me of lethal weapon ceiling is being painted here it's just a family room kind of okay not much gonna be here actually over there is gonna be accent wall okay and over here is a office come on guys it was some old wallpaper on the walls so uh -huh. we had to scrape it then we repaired this the, the texture paint it and we decided to keep this how come Hmm? Why are they keeping that for? Uh, they just liked it, you know. There is okay. a crown molding on the ceiling, and our designer she decided that we can, you know, integrate it into design. So it's going to be kind of transitional. You hear that? He said, "Our designer. They have an in-house design team, which is, I think, it's Anna, right?" Uh, design. No, no. We have another design, Cat. Okay. Well, his wife designed my condo. She did a really good job. Yeah, for design, we have a professional designer who's who doing all the three D yeah. renderings, and we can visualize it. It's just a cool. laundry laundry room here. Yeah, laundry room back there. Then what? We got the other bedrooms over here too, right? Yeah. So look, look at this primary. Yeah. So that's the primary bedroom. Mm -hmm. Accent wall is going to be over here. Okay. Just a different color, and we're going to have some. You know, meal work done. Oh, nice. And uh, Dang, master good. bathroom. You guys are putting a, a standalone tub or are you guys going to frame it in? So actually, it's, it's an interesting tub that's going to be here. It's a jacuzzi tub mm, that you here. can yeah. open a, a door and get in. You know, it's like a... For oh, is it like one of those high ones? Yeah, it's going to be like this, this high. Okay. And uh, you open the door from here and you get it. It's not it's comfortable for older people to use. Mm -hmm. It's a jacuzzi and they can walk in without, you know, jumping through the... So this right. is going to be separate. Is this going to be built in with this? Yeah, so here is going to be a shower. Mm -hmm. Then we're going to have a pony wall. Okay. And then pony wall on this side. Got it. Then and you have the glass that probably comes up here. Glass here and the door swings here then, right? Yep. Okay, nice. And uh, tile all the way to the ceiling. Okay. On this wall, we're gonna have LED mirrors and some accent tile over there. Then we have the uh, two sinks right here. Okay, cool. Yeah. And the custom vanity. Well, it's gonna look night and day. So we have the bathroom here. Oh, you guys did all this, huh? You guys yeah. sealed all this up? Is this the original tub or no? No, that's a brand new tub. Uh, everything is waterproofed. Okay. So basically all this is going to be tiled. Looks like you added a new soap box here. Mm -hmm. uh, looks like toilet's going to go here. We're just going to do one sink. And what uh, mirror are you guys going to use? LED mirror as well. LED? Okay, cool. And this is just the uh, bedroom, right? Yeah, and the bedroom. Guys, so bedroom. This is a pretty large bedroom here. So basically this is going to be standard. You guys doing carpet or tile in here? Tile throughout. Nice. All right, let's so take a look at that backyard. See what that backyard is all about. Pretty decent sized backyard. Yeah, the backyard, they want to do something here, like outdoor living. The thing is, ma the main goal is to get it ready for, for homeowners to move in. Yeah. And then once they moved in, we can work with the designer, figure out what we're going to do on the backyard. Yeah, this is a huge backyard, man. Yeah, so there is more space over there on the side yard. So that's where we're planning to do some outdoor living, you know, mm -hmm. outdoor kitchen. 
outdoor kitchen over here, some maybe hot top. I don't know, what would you do with all this? I mean, hey, drop a comment below. Let us know what ideas you may have for this lot here. I think at least it needs some landscaping, you yeah. know, some privacy from the neighbors, some larger plants yeah. on that side, this side. I mean, you can literally put a pool in here. If you okay, guys, to. if you guys want to see what this property is going to look like when it's completed, let us know in the comments below. Also, support your local businesses. If you are looking to remodel your home, contact Design Zone Remodeling. I'm going to have a link in the description below. Vitaly, close out on this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, guys.